Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing? And so I'm back with uh, my mid-year favorites uh, number two. And that's uh, because I had too many really for one video, so I'm coming back for a second video. So I thought I'd start out with a couple of things that I missed in the first video. Loving this cookie blush. This one is in Crushing. And it's just... Um, their newer formula. You can get this on the Cookie website. Um, I haven't seen them in grocery stores yet, but Cookie's usually available in the Kroger grocery stores. Um, you can find the Thicket Naked, <laughs> bah, bah, bah. Uh, Thicket Stick It from NYX, and this one is in the Cool Ash Brown. I also have the Cool Ash Blonde, and I like both of these shades, and it's a really good formula. So, uh, really liking those. Uh, Juvia's Place, their Disco Gloss. Love this one. And let me see, as far as the face palette that I actually have on today, which I think would be absolutely wonderful for traveling, is the Dream Team by Physicians Formula. And this one has um, just a, yeah, a wonderful selection. Um, today I actually used this one to go ahead and contour. This one is my bronzer. Uh, this one is my blush. And then this one is my highlighter. So um, if you're traveling and you want to, you know, pare everything down, this one definitely is a nice small palette that you could definitely, uh, yeah, completely travel with. And it's so cute on the inside with its vacay mode. Just love that picture. So anyway, um, yeah, uh, definitely one of my favorites for mid-year. As far as eyeshadow palettes, well, one more thing before eyeshadow palettes. Um, she Glam, and this is in Beach Babe. It's their lipstick, and I'm really liking the formula. It's what I have on right now, so really liking that. And... Um, Let's see, starting with uh, some of the palettes that I'm liking. Uh, again, from She Glam, you can get She Glam on the Sheen website. And this one is their uh, Cosmic Crystal Five Color Eyeshadow Palette. And so I do have some of this on today. I did use this lighter color um, to go ahead and sort of carve out the brows. Kinda. And um, so that's what I have on there. Um, really enjoying the ColourPop palettes. These three are part of the Celestial um, series that they did. And so this one is clearly in love. And this one has uh, red, basically. You can get a really light look with this, or if you go ahead and um, add in some of the mattes or the mattes uh, with sparkle, mattes with glimmer. Um, you can build up these looks to look really dark. The top two rows are actually a new ColourPop formula, and this one is um, more of a cream formula, and they blend really well together. Again, you can go from a really light look to a really dark look with this. And the next one is going to be Clear the Air. And this one is more of a peachy brown. Um, and these all, the top two rows are going to be the newer formula. And they all have a super shock in the middle as well. And again, um, adding in some of the darker mattes and you can really make the look go darker. And then the third one, which I have on today, hmm, excuse me, is actually the um, Coast is Clear palette. And so I went ahead and used, uh, let's see, this is my base, and then I used some of this and some of uh, this on the inner corner, and then uh, some of this all over the lid. So that's what I have on today. And again, a really pretty palette. Again, you can go really light or really dark with it. And these three are actually going to be over at Ulta here pretty soon. So um, again, they're part of the Celestial, uh, the Celestial series. And um, the clear plastic is actually really heavy duty. So I think it's going to last really well. And 
let me go ahead and grab some of the other ones here. Um, let's see. With all the green going around lately, the Earthy by Beauty Bay. Uh, Beauty Bay, you do have to order on their website, and they do do a combination of um, makeup and skincare. And I have some of their skincare that I really like as well. Um, but this is their Earthy palette. It's a nine palette. Uh, with this one, I also have um, the Berries palette. And with this collection, they did a 9 palette, a 16 palette, and a 42 palette for each of the three different colors that they did. And um, so this is the 9 pan palette. And then let me show you the berries. It's a 16 pan palette. And these have a lot of pigment. And um, they really do include, I mean, this has some coral, a couple of pinks, and a lot of berries in it. So it's a really pretty palette. Um, so these are the two from Beauty Bay. Again, you can get them on the website. And then um, as far as my other ColourPop, I am just really liking uh, this. And this is from, I guess it's called the Stone because this one is set in stone and this one is twist of slate uh, but they're in the same set and you can get them together and uh, so for everyday looks or if you want to go glam uh, with these uh, pretty shimmers you can definitely go glam and then twist of slate is this one and again really liking this one quite a lot and again, you can do um, just like one shimmer over your lid um, or, yeah, on the lid if you just want to go ahead and do that or you can build it up to a total glam look. These also have uh, one cream eyeshadow over in the corner and actually both of them do. So this is the cream eyeshadow in this one. And you can use the cream eyeshadow as the base if you want to um, or you can use it by itself. So yeah these are both really nice palettes that i've been liking a lot um my other one is from profusion the desert sage this came out in springtime and with profusion you can get it at walmart um, or on walmart.com and really pretty um they do uh just really pretty pigments and they have a couple of duochromes in here that are really pretty as well and so I have a couple of videos with this palette and really like it. Um, again, it's, you know, the, it's such a pretty color uh, selection and color stories that I don't mind it taking up a little bit more room than maybe it should. So, you know, storage is storage. So, um, but uh, with green being so huge this year, the Limelight palette, and this one's by ColourPop. I've really been enjoying this as well, and um, definitely go ahead and uh, I found that uh, going ahead and wetting my brush with um, some fixing spray or some uh, whatever to make these sparkle just they turn into a creamy texture and it's just really gorgeous. So. Uh, lo loving the limelight one as well and um, let's see by the rosé yeah this one yeah so yeah this one is a really pretty one and you can get all sorts of uh, rose looks from it and then the rock candy by ColourPop as well so um, this one came out this year and like I said, I'm loving it. I have smudges all over it because I use it a lot. And um, yeah, this is the way that it looks. It has a lot of really pretty shimmers. It has a couple of actual glitters. I think um, this one is glitter. This one is a glitter. And is it this one? So it's um, actually, sorry, it's, uh, this one, this one, and this one are your glitters. And um, other than that, it's just really fun formula and a lot of sparkles. So it's a really fun palette as well. And I think that's just about, yeah, everything. So, um, oh, 
I had one more thing as usual. So uh, the Cheeky Rose Beauty Blush, or Cheeky Rose Beauty Brush, and I use it for blush. Um, I also use it for contour and bronzer, and it's just a really uh, very dense brush, very thick brush, and it uh, feels very soft and it applies everything really well. And the other brush that I've really been enjoying as well is the Elf um, Putty Brush. And uh, so I'm really enjoying using this as well. Again, this one has, um, it's going to be pretty dense as well, but it definitely isn't as dense as this brush is. Um, but they both really uh, just help with the application with uh, the e.l.f. bronzers and the e.l.f. putty blushes. I find that this really works really well. And um, I think that's just about everything that I have for, at mid-year. And uh, thank you and have a great day, okay? Bye.